Hello friends, this is Shantanu and welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to talk about how we can create a beautiful table in WordPress. So in this video, the plugin I'm going to use is WP Table Builder. This is one of the best plugins to create a table in WordPress. You can create beautiful responsive tables. You can provide like buttons, you can upload images and the table that you will create with the help of this plugin is going to be very, very beautiful. Just uh, I'm going to show you first uh, their website. So if you just scroll down and come here, you can see that this is a kind of a product uh, product listing table. So these kind of tables are very much popular in Amazon affiliate websites. There are a couple of paid plugins also with the help of them. You can create these kind of tables, but this is a free plugin. And with the help of this free plugin, you can actually create this kind of table. And in this video, I'm going to share the complete tutorial to create a a beautiful table like this in WordPress. So you can see that uh, they have got very good reviews also. And one of my reviews also has been published in this uh, blog or website. You can see that this is myself. So let's go to the demo website and let's install this plugin and try to create a table like this. So first of all, what we need to do, we need to go to the plugin section, click on add new button search for WP table builder. Now, if you are using any kind of uh, page builder plugin like Thrive Architect or Elementor, then you do not need this kind of plugin because with the help of those uh, page builder, you can create tables automatically. For example, let me show you my blog where I'm using Thrive theme builder and all the tables that I've created in this post i have used thrive architect plugin only for example so this is a table that i have created for this black friday post so you can see that so this table i have created with the help of thrive architect so if you are using elementor plugin then definitely there will be an element to create a table so for those kind of websites who are using theme builder or page builder you do not need to install an additional table plugin other than that if you are not at all using any kind of a page builder plugin you have to install a table plugin definitely you can use the gutenberg table also but those tables are not that much beautiful you cannot create this kind of like beautiful table with gutenberg so this is the plugin i'm talking about wp table builder so you just install the plugin activate it fine so fine. so in the left side you can see that double table builder has come so just let's click on it so there is some permission it is asking allow and continue okay again let's go to the table builder so now this is the dashboard where okay, let's close this messages okay so let's create a table now click on add new Fine. So now uh, this is the interface. So here first we need to decide how many columns and how many rows. So let's say we are going to create the exact same table. Okay. So one, two, three, four, five. So there are five columns and rows as many products as you want to list. So for the time being, let's create five column first. So there are five columns and row. Let's say we will create three rows. So the number of products you want to list, you can create as many rows. So click on generate. So this is the table structure has generated. Now what we can do, we need to, in the left side, you can see there are a couple of elements like text, button, image, list, star rating, custom HTML, shortcode. Okay. So, so you can use these elements to design a table. So what we can do, just simply click on it, drag and drop here. So let's say we'll give serial number this way. Okay. You just double click on it center it make it bold you can also copy it then drag and drop it here copy it drag and drop it here copy drag and drop copy drag and drop so see how beautiful and how easy it is to create a table like this complete drag and drop interface and it's really fun for me to create a table like this okay preview product rating and view so we will also save the name way so let's say 
picture we'll put a picture here then we or let's say we'll put the product name then picture then price or let's say review okay yeah ratings and let's say discount okay so this way we will we give the header now what we will do we need to put the so this is serial number so what we can do again drag it here so let's say one dot copy this is two serial number one serial number two okay next is product name so let's say again you can copy it and drag and drop it so this is a prd one product one something whatever is the valid product you can put it here i'm just giving an example so let's say prd two okay picture so let's download few pictures from here itself so let me download those pictures so i have downloaded the pictures now what i can do from this side i can drag this image element here and put it here so it will ask me to upload those pictures so let me upload those pictures here so both the pictures has uploaded just giving an alt text so whenever you upload a picture make sure to give the alt text at least okay so let me put it here so i kept the picture so there is something called image size also so you can play with the size also okay if you want to put a link in the image you can do it here also then open no follow convert relative link to absolutes okay so there are a couple of things so let me copy it and paste it here itself so again replace the image now i'll put the second image so we gave serial number product name picture so let me reduce the size a little bit 70% okay so let me try to type something okay so typing looks like it's not so i'm trying to put type 70 but it's not allowing me so anyway let me scroll down to 70 for the same also i'll make it 70% okay so small picture now here i need to put a star ratings okay so there is an element called star rating just drag and drop it here so let's say this is 4.5 i can copy so let's say this is 4.5 and this is 5 okay you can control it here from here also so size you can reduce the size also 17 color also you can change star star ratings is how many stars you want to give so that also you can change show number rating so you can populate the number also so for the same also i'll do the same settings okay so you can see that so many things you can actually control with this amazing plugin okay so rating has done now let's put some button so this is the button text so let's say get 10 percent off you just select it and then you can say small button you can say medium button whatever way you want button size also you can you can control it right here so maybe a small button is fine text size let me reduce it okay so from the left side we can do a lot of things so let's say i'll copy this one insert a link open no follow okay again i'll copy and paste it here so let's say this is something 30 percent so you can see that almost our in fact we have uh, done with the table design let me put it five now what you can do you can simply save the table click on preview so you can see that now the table will look like this so this is really really a very beautiful table and we have created this table so easily with the help of this plugin drag and drop and lots of features almost everything you need to create a complete beautiful table for any kind of affiliate website or your main website so one more thing is like so now you want to embed this table in a blog post so what you can do you just click on this embed now this is the short code that you have to copy then you need to go to your blog all post and create a new post then put this short code here put a title like this is a demo tutorial okay 
just save it and now preview it okay so you can see that this is a demo tutorial so this is the let's say this is a blog post and in this blog post this is the way you can control the table now the biggest advantage of using a table plugin is let's say you have created a common table which you want to use in more than three to four articles so you can happily use the table whenever you want to change the anything in this table you just need to come to this place in wordpress in this table area and change the particular table the change will be reflecting in all the articles so that's all in this video uh, if i hope i'm able to explain everything about how to create a beautiful table in wordpress with the help of this wp table builder plugin if you have any question related to this you can write a comment in this video i'll definitely help you by replying to your comment or else if required i'll create a dedicated video also on your question in coming days if you find this video useful feel free to like this video and also share this video and if you are new to my youtube channel then subscribe to this channel so that whenever i upload a new video you get the notification immediately so see you in the next video till then take care and goodbye